Hello everyone, Stars RJ here, so I tip the scales of another game of Mass Effect 2. Alright, so we're nearing the end of Act 1. I say that because, well, yeah. Act 1 is nearing its end. And then, I, then the real then the real part of the game no opens up. For you, Commander. Oh, okay, not the real part of the game opening up, but a lot more of the game opens up when I um have to recruit the Krogan. So let's get out of here. Yep, I could go to Project Overlord, but again, I'll do that after I've recruited some more people. We've got stuff to work with. Corliss. Let's go to Corliss and land. Well, let's see, I think I'll be facing Blue Sun's Merc, so... I like Kazumi and... Garrus. <laughs> Yep. <laughs> yep. Garrus, Kazumi, whatever. Nope, nothing to upgrade. Let's get out of here then. Missile, missile, missile. We got the locust. I planned. The dossier doesn't say if Okir is on this planet by choice. Assume hostiles. Yeah. Hmm. Loudspeakers. Someone likes the sound of their voice. Stay focused. Yep. We're looking for a Krogan warlord. Someone likes the sound of their voice. Like me. I like the sound of my voice. It might sound differently on your end, but it sounds nice on my end. Isn't that how we operate? Canned orders over loudspeaker. Canned orders over loudspeaker. That's um someone might say. It's a trope as well. Look out, post ahead. They're ready. They're ready for us. Well, oh, Shadow Strike him. Yeah, worst Shadow Strike ever. Of all time. That was like the worst Shadow Strike ever. Of all time. Alright, switch to Sniper Rifle. I mean, a submachine gun could have not been used here, but seriously, that submachine gun is badass. Hello, wounded Merc. Shit. Shit. I won't stop bleeding. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Son of a bitch. Hello. Doesn't look that bad, actually. He doesn't need to know that. I knew it wasn't Berserkers. Ah, not at range. You're Mercs. Or Alliance. I'm not... I'm not telling you anything. Oh, I've got oh. a nice application of Metagel ready to go. But if you'd rather I just keep walking. Son of a bitch. I just... I don't know anything. I just shoot the overflow from the labs. The old Krogan up there... Uh-oh. He's really been cleaning house lately. What? Jador hired him to make her an army. But the Krogan he creates are insane. So we use them for live ammo training. It's all crap. I don't get paid enough to goddamn bleed out. Outpost huh? 4, Jador wants us to move. We need coordinates on that Krogan pack. Reply of bad directions. You heard the man on the radio? He needs direction. <laughs> I, I don't have the info they want. You showed up before I could get my normal sightings. You have other problems. Patrol, uh, uh, pack sighting east of station two. Yeah. Copy, east of two. <laughs> Son of a bitch. They'll run blind into Krogan. Hmm. Have you seen Okir? Does he know about all of this? We can't go in the labs, but everyone sees what happens when the Krogan come out. I've shot hundreds. They're crazy, mindless. Anyone up there, they know what's going on. Why Krogan? What's the door planning to do with all these Krogan? What do you think? Replace us, probably. I sure wouldn't want to see an army of them coming at me. Only she can't control them. They aren't supposed to be crazy, but they're Krogan. How smart are they to start? Hmm. Is Jador's lab heavily guarded? There are big guns to keep ships away. We're not outfitted to fight goddamn commandos. Well, better start running. If you start limping now, you might find a shady spot before you bleed out. Shit. Oh, shit. Oh. I think Why chase him off so soon? Some people need a heavy hand. Huh? Come on. Our but I didn't give him his med gel. Uh, it's, so, it's so helpful. I mean, seriously, he was... <laughs> he was being so helpful. Then stay down. 
Slow dance, sniper time. Scratch one. Jump. Doot, 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 doot. You gotta jump. All right, let's see. You're gonna get flash banged, and you are going to fall over. And play dead. It's easy, see? Yeah, see? And you're gonna get shot in the head. And I really need to put some put some ammunition on this thing. Yep. Fine, sit down. Sit down. I said sit down. All right, you all sat down. Great. Good, because you know. Could use a, you could use a bit more sit down. Sit down! Nice. Oh, in the head. Well, if he wasn't dead before, he is now. And you're also you. <laughs> That's what, sniper, that's what a sniper, being a sniper is all about. Standing out in the open with a sniper rifle and sh shooting everyone. <laughs> and shooting everyone while you're not prone. You know, that's how snipers work, right? Boom, in the head. You two in the head. The ammo. <sighs> Sit down. All right, switch to the locust. Oh, never mind. Hello, Krogan. You seem friendly. Calm down. You are different. You. You don't smell like this world. Seven night cycles, and I have felt only the need to kill. But you... Something makes me speak. Night cycles. Seven days. I bred full grown. You must breed them full size, ready to kill. Not much improvement over regular mercs if they need training. <laughs> bred... to kill. No. I kill because my blood and bone tell me to. But it's not why I was flushed from Glass Mother. Hmm. Survival is what I hear in my head. Against the enemy that threatens all my kind. But I failed, even before waking. Uh-oh. That is what the voice in the water said. That is why I wait here. Really? You're supposed to be part of a mercenary army. Do you remember Jador? No. I know that name. It causes anger. But also laughter. It is not a name that will be sung when we march. I see. I don't know what that means, but I have heard it many times. How can you speak if you're only a week old? There was a scratching sound in my head, and it became the voice. It taught things I would need. Walking, talking, hitting, shooting. Of course. Then the voice said I was not perfect, and the teaching stopped. And now I am here. I see. It was taught enough to be judged. I still don't know what the goal was, though. I we'll find don't know, out. but I am not perfect. Okir's voice? Did he speak to you while you were in your tank? I heard the voice. Not like now, with ears. Inside. I called it Father. It liked that. But it was disappointed. Son, I am disappointed. I'm not what it needs me to be. A lab with Krogans. Sounds like an attempt to cure the genophage. Cure? Cure was never whispered. Survive, resist, ignore. Hmm. I destroyed Saren's cure. How does Okira expect these Krogan to ignore the genophage if not by curing it? No idea. Doesn't look like he's had much success so far. How did you disappoint the voice? I don't know. I don't know. It was decided before I left Tank Mother. I was not perfect. Maybe spending his week-long childhood in a tank made him crazy, like that Merc said. I don't know of that, hmm. but I'm not perfect. Show me this lab. Show Can me what you, show you got. Me the laboratory? 
I need to speak with Okir. The Glass Mother. She is up past the broken parts behind many of you fleshy things. I will show you. Thanks, man. You're the best. Glad he's friendly. <laughs> Yeah, I don't want to mess with this guy. What are you gonna do now? What are you gonna do now? Well, I'm gonna stand here, wait to be judged. You fleshy things are slow when big things are in your way. Hmm. You could have run, or tried to fight your way back to the lab. Why stay here? I am waiting. The voice told me if they come, I fight. But I will not run, and I will not follow. I see. I am not perfect, but I have purpose. I must wait until called. Released. Hmm. Sounds bad. All right, Krogan Blood Rage. Stay sharp. When a Krogan gets, when a Krogan loses one of the nervous systems, they they have to switch to another one. Yeah, so they switch they switch to another nervous system. When that happens, they get really really angry. Yeah, they get really really angry, and, that, and that's what's called the Blood Rage. It's dangerous. Dangerous thing to try and exploit. Krogan Berserker, huh? Oh, flashbangs! Flashbangs work on everyone, it seems. Sit down. That also works, knocking him off the edge. I was gonna say, why should I shoot my cover? Wait, who gave him guns? Shields up! Alright, uh... Yeah, you're... Looks like you're finished. Shadow strike him. Oh, I said shadow strike him. Nice, Kazumi. Wait, what did I do that for? What did I just drop the rounds? We're on cryo rounds. Your shotgun. Your shotgun. Do not use it. Oh, we need more ammo here. Need a dispenser here. Yep. Take a med kit. Oh, hello. Hello, sir. Can I just hear the words of Mayneth? No? Okay, then. Well, never mind. Oh, nice one. Nice one, Kazumi. Where are the heavies? Well, where all heavies are. The heavy shop. Right? Okay then, let's go kill some more Krogan. Let's go capture some buildings! Yeehaw! Keep rolling and rolling on. Bypass station here. Alright, let's see. Yep. That, do that. And all that. Aha, door open. Doors open, boys! Yeehaw! Careful, you might get stuck in a corner. Well, not here, obviously. This is valuable. Ooh. Increase snub rifle damage with that scan. Which means, speak your snub rifle, let's switch to it. Boom! In your head! Oh! What's this? I'm sorry, did you just die? Actually, why am I sorry? Why am I sorry about your death? Wait, what did I just find? No. Oh. Oh, I missed down a hundred credits. Headshot. Headshot. Supposed to be a battle here or something. All right. Why are the overloads? Shield up. Ready, guns! Oh, in your face! 
in your head. One more. Come on. You make me waste ammo on you. Oh, we got the heavy. I was wondering, wait, where's the heavy so I can get its ammo? Or so I can kill it so it doesn't use its ammo, so it doesn't shoot me with a rocket or whatever. Uh, probably you? Yeah, I'm blaming you. I'm blaming you for giving them arms. I mean, why do they need arms? They can just use their legs fine, right? Do they, do they actually need their arms? Jeez, come on. Here we go, all done. <laughs> Alrighty. So, we have more money. We have more cash dollars to work with. We gotta buy more stuff. My favourite part of the Citadel. Boom! In the face! Uh, you, flashbang please! Flashbangs are ready! Burn your- burn them all! Oh, right, rockets. We got the rockets! Overload their systems, and I'll deal the headshots. Boom! Right in your face! What? Where are they? What are they doing? I said they were still incoming! Repeat! Still incoming! Still incoming! I repeat! Do you comply? Do you comply? I repeat, do you comply? Do you re comply? <laughs> Insubordination detected. <laughs> move, move, move! So, yes, sir! Hmm. Could save some ammo. Headshot. Right. Nope, miss. Flashbangs are ready. Right in your face. Alright, switch into this. Alright. You expose yourself. Now you're dead. Okay, um, I'm actually terrible at shooting things. With my gun. Well, good thing this gun has actually got some accuracy to it. Got a lot of accuracy to it. Well, you know what they say about girls and their toys? Hey, <laughs> everyone likes toys. Don't lie. Ah! Uh, you, gotta you gotta love those frantic messages. And it turns out, the name of the murderer is... Ah! So, if I, was ever, if I was ever doing that kind of thing, like, you know, if I was gonna... If I had to give out secret intel or whatever, I'm not gonna go like, you know, hey, you know who the murderer was? Yeah, let, oh, I'll come to you... Oh. I'll come to you later with the uh, name of the murderer. I'll come to your house later with the name of the murderer, and, you know, I'll tell you then. It's like, no, I'll tell you right now. The name of the, the, name of the killer is... Ah! Yeah, so like, you know... This is the audio log of Stars RG. I have uncovered a secret that you will never believe. The name of the murderer is this guy. Okay, now, here's what he did. What's all like that? Or as soon as you pick up the audio log, it's like, pick up the audio log. The name of the murderer is this guy. Now, so this is Stars RG here, telling you all about this guy and all his secrets. See? Then you start, then you do all that. Yeah. Come on, expose yourselves. Please? I'll pay you money. I'll pay you money to expose yourselves. <laughs> yes, get off the speakers, you. Get off the phone. I could, I could just, you know, I could probably do it with a submachine gun. Just, just waltz on through the submachine gun. Probably a bad idea, but why not? Why not try?
Flashbang! Ow. Okay, that's probably a bad. That was a bad. That was a horrible idea. Of all time. Oh, really? Well, that was a waste of a cloak. Oh, and then I just then I died. Guess I didn't shoot enough. Guess I wasn't shooting at the right targets. Alrighty then. Oi! And you! And you! And you! Die! I want you dead. I want your cat dead, your dog dead, and your wife dead. Oh, nice one, Kazumi. Thank you. So let's see. Legionnaire. Yeah, you lost visual for a second. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Flashbang, please. Overload their shields. And actually, now I'm going to switch to the sniper rifle. Headshot. Headshot. Boom. I know it was a grazing blow there, but hey, grazing blows count. Uh, cloaking engaged. Yeah, flashbangs are ready. Yep, and take cover. Okay, we got some cut. We got heavies. We got heavies on the courtyard. Well, it could say overload them, but they they have no shields. So flashbang them, and switch to a sniper rifle. So to facilitate an easier destruction of their heads. And you, Garrus. Oh, whoa, 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 take cover. Headshot, please. Kazumi. Headshot. Man, we got one more heavy over here. Boom. Right in your shoulder. That'll kill you. Shoulder shots are dangerous, you know. Yep, you can't see a thing. Flashbang! Okay, that was bad plan, bad, 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 bad plan, bad plan, plan, bad plan. <laughs> Boom. Wait for it. Okay, cloaking engaged. Everyone's dead. Nope, down. Down, but not out. Yeah, good luck with that. <laughs> yeah, idiot. Okay, when you have your rocket, when you have your rocket, be sure to fire it. Don't just go. Eh, there's not going to shoot at me. Yeah, it's not like it's going to happen because you know I will shoot you with my gun in your face. Take the sniper rifle out again. Sniper rifle's versatile. Just like, you know, the... Oh, no one's in here. Yeah, if I play Mass Effect 1, there's a, a Sari named Rana who will appear out and say like, Hey! You know, uh, you spared me from the, um, from the Krogan Labs, from Okia's Krogan Labs, you know. And I'm working here, I'm working the wrong side again, aren't I? And you're like, yep. Now get out of here before I start shooting. Or you can shoot her there. However, it's best you shoot her. She's actually bad. She's been doc indoctrinated by the Reapers. Here you are. I've watched your progress. I see. Before I do that, though, um, hold on a second. Need to bypass this terminal. 
Right, that looks like it. And there we go. Terminal bypassed. This is valuable. Yay, I've upgraded the Kro Krogan Vitality. That'll really help Okia out. It's about time. The batteries on these tanks will not wait while you play with these idiotic mercs. Okia, okay, I presume? I take it you're Okia. You don't seem particularly caged. Or grateful that I'm here. You may claim to be here to help. But the formerly deceased Shepherd is not a sign of gentle change. I see. Surprised. All Krogan should know you. Or have you forgotten your actions on Vermeer? Hmm. I'm sure you're eager to retell the story. Oh dear. Such a tale. Saren, the Spectre Traitor, threatens the return of the Krogan Horde by curing the Genophage, undoing the gentle genocide of the Turians and Salarians. But before Saren can deliver his endless troops, in rides Shepard, securing victory through nuclear fire. I like that part. It has weight. I bet you will too. I'm sure you're eager oh, to wait. retell the story. Such oh, wait, oops. But Tough decision. Saren I didn't have a lot of room for finesse. If there'd been any other solution, I'd have considered it. But I approve. Saren's pale horde were not true Krogan. Numbers alone are nothing. The mistake of an outsider, one that these mercenaries have also made. Mm-hmm. Indeed. I gave their leader my rejects for her army, but she grows impatient. It's time for you to take me out of here. Yep, whatever. We'll do that. But wait a second. We're here about collectors, not your problems. I see. Yes, collector attacks have increased. A human concern. My requests were focused elsewhere. Hmm. What's this? I acquired the knowledge to create one pure soldier. With that, I will inflict upon the Genophage the greatest insult an enemy can suffer. To be ignored. Uh, what? Your search for the perfect soldier created a lot of failures. You don't care about them? I feel no one. My rejects are exactly what Jador asked for. She simply lacks the ability to command. They are strong. Healthy and useless to me. I need perfection. If a few thousand are rejected, so be it. I see. My work will purify the Krogan. We will not be restored. We will be renewed. Wait, you don't want a horde? I thought the Krogan ideal was a return to the numbers that threatened the galaxy. No. We will not need numbers. My soldier is a template. It is a greater threat than all the phantom siblings hmm. that would have been at its flank. I see. The galaxy still bears the scars of the Horde, but it will learn to fear the lands. I see. You're just as cruel and manipulative as those who released the Genophage on your people. Eh. Perhaps. But I will restore the Krogan, and my soldier will not provoke a nuclear response as a cure or Horde would. I see. My legacy is perfection. With each pure Krogan reaching higher by standing on our dead, they will exceed, but not forget. I see. What did you get from the Collectors? I need whatever you know about them. They are strange. So isolated, yet very available when your sacrifice is big enough. I gave them many Krogan. I see. I may have information for you, but the tech was consumed in my prototype. After I determined how to use it without killing the subjects. Mm -hmm. The deaths were unfortunate, but I only need one success to start the process. Alright. So you don't want to cure the Genophage? Of course not. Contrary to what survivors claim, the Genophage does not produce strong Krogan. The only quality it filters is the ability to survive the Genophage. I see. For every thousand stillborn, too many weaklings live. Every survivor is branded as precious. That's produced more cuddling than your collective human teeth. Right. <laughs> I say, let us carry the genophage. Let a thousand die in a clutch. We will defeat it by climbing atop our dead. That is the Krogan way. Alright, can't really take can't really find much fault in that. Why why protect why like every every Krogan that is born is considered to be weak just to survive the genophage. Doesn't actually account for strength or agility or whatever. Nope, it just survived. So, you know, this guy's saying, we'll make the most perfect soldier, it'll carry the genophage, but it'll be the most strongest soldier out there, and we can clone that one. Your methods are extreme, but you know how to deconstruct a threat. Will you help us? 
Perhaps I can strike a deal to secure passage. But my prototype is not negotiable. It is the key to my legacy. So we gotta um, you know. So in order to recruit Okia. Okay, I have traced the Krogan release. Okia, of course. Oh dear. What are you gonna do now? <gasps> Flushing the tanks? No! No! Sounds horrifying. She'll kill my legacy with a damn valve. Shepard, you want information on the collectors? Stop her. She'll try to access contaminants in the storage bay. Why so concerned? You can just start over like she plans to. What's the big deal? This tank is pure. It involved as much trial as data. Starting over will not duplicate it. It must survive. I see. The door will be with the rejected text. Kill her. I will stay and do what must be done. All right. Uh, before I do that, though, let's check the time. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna actually end the video here. So while um, you know, I'll deal with it all later and and rescue and save Oak here and all that stuff. But that'll be for the next video of the Stars RJ, and I'm going to tip the scales in the favour of everything. Signing off!